マジキナミヤいざ尋常に一本目勝負 Alright, so my opponent here, Mulligan, I've been fighting them a few times on me But they pulled out Mina on me one time, like destroyed me, so I guess that's what they're trying to do here is they swap to this character again to like destroy me with just all these projectiles. I was having so much trouble getting in, but like I'm trying to adapt. I'm trying to stay on top of my opponent while also being aware like they need to like I tried to dash and block there, but I was just too slow. It's really difficult because like I don't know what Mina can do, I don't know what all of her abilities are. So, like, I'm continually running into attacks that I'm either seeing for the first time, or I'm just not very used to yet. Yeah, so, yeah no, man. Gotta just block. Like, when you're trying to figure out how to approach someone who's using projectiles or zoning you out, you just gotta block a lot, right? Because the more you block, the more you'll start to understand, like, oh, okay, this is what he can use, it hits at this angle, or it hits at this speed. And I should either try to run in here, I should try to jump over here. Like, obviously this is a lot more difficult than, like, say, like, Street Fighter V. Just some character that has a Hadouken in him. That just is like, okay, three different speeds of the Hadouken, uh, light, medium, heavy, and they all just travel left to right. Versus Mika over here, just shooting all these arrows. Is the ones where she's shooting, like, on the ground there. She has that flip shot. Like, there's so many different angles, so many different speeds, but we got her, man. Yeah, as soon as I got her into that corner, I was like, yeah, let's just completely stay on top of her. I don't want to give her any chance to escape. So yeah, again, being really careful to avoid that jump. And yeah, like, I'm trying to stop her from leaving like she does, but she's just so fast. But oh my goodness, dude, this game and the rage. I hit her, what, like three times? And she just died. I think her character might have lower health as well. I'm not entirely sure how that works in this game. I know some characters uh, do have lower health though. But yeah, no nah, man, that was pretty good. Like, this Mina was kicking my butt earlier and we're actually doing quite a bit better. And yeah, they're just gonna go back to Mina. Because again, like, out of all the characters the Mulligan's played against me, Mina's the only one that's been taking games. Like, I think I lost this dude once. But yeah, the Mina, when I lost that, it was very decisive. It wasn't close at all. But yeah, we're definitely getting better. And you know, I don't know why it's lagging so bad. But yeah, here we go. Trying to trap her into the corner. <laughs> this is so bad, right? Because like, I think it works like Samurai Showdown 7, where they can do the e Sun or whatever, that just does like 75% of your HP. But yeah, no man, I just feel like this Mina is going to use that attack, so I'm just trying to stay on top of her and bam, the rage is gone. And like, something I see a lot of Samurai Showdown players say is you should never use your rage mode, or like your e or whatever, in round one. Because like, this is the very first round, right? When you use that rage meter or the e or whatever, you lose your rage It's just gone. Forever. Though, mind you, she did, uh, she did knock me out there. She did win that round. But yeah, without the rage, like, that means you're gonna deal lower damage for the next round, potentially next two rounds. You don't have the chance to do that first. And the burst can knock you out combos. Oh yeah, I did the, uh, the match attack there. I forget that attack exists. I'm not sure if it's in Samurai Showdown 7. I don't think I ever see, uh, Charlotte use it. Yeah, no, man, she's doing a good job. Just staying away. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm trying so hard to get the pits of it, but it's just not the right thing. And like, I keep trying to jump and use my like, low hitting attack there. I think it's my medium slash. But just so many times when Mina's ducking, like she's crouch blocking. So I should get the high hit, but doesn't quite reach all the way down there. I hit her a lot easier when she's standing, like when she was shooting that barrage. This is tough, I know. Yup, 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 she got me. Ah. Yo, we were trying, man. We were really trying, but it did not work out. Yo, fighting is so unnecessary.
Yeah, Mulligan and Mew, we actually have a similar number of wins. I don't believe that's against each other, I believe that's just in general. Because I don't really know how the online works in Samurai Showdown 5 Perfect Neo Geo Collection 2020. But yeah, no, man. It's cool that uh, there's just a lot of people playing this game. And it seems to match me against people that are rather um, new, like myself, so that's pretty cool. Oh, so yeah, it's not as clear-cut as, like, other games, right, where it's like, hey, you're bronze rank, you're super rank, and this is what your opponent is, yeah. Just showed me the number of wins. Oh, he lost me. Or wait, maybe it showed that I wasn't paying too much attention, but yeah, no, man. Let's just beat this Mina, yeah? It's like, when I jump up with her... That seems to be going pretty good, like, unless it's, like, right next to her, right? Because she can do that down shot, and I'll jump into that, which, like, that could have been in right there. But yeah, even that jump shot has, like, multiple angles. All the time burning up, too. I have the advantage, but not by a lot, so, yeah, I feel like I have to go in. It'd be really easy for her to win through time. Just gotta block, just gonna block. <laughs> we take those. Oh. Uh... That was scary. I wasn't sure I was gonna win that. Wow. Dude, she's doing a lot of empty jumps. And did that really hit? Dude, she hit my rapier, dude. I'm holding out my rapier, and she's like, yeah, that'll just extend your hurt box, so thanks. Flip move. Really gotta figure that out. And then, yeah, she used a grounded, like, uh, projectile there, and it still beat my jump. Gotta time it better. I think I'm playing just a little too aggressive. I need to like chill out a little bit, but oh, that's good damage. Oh, I tried to do the jump heavy, it didn't work, and then yeah, that was... There's no way I saw that coming. There's no way. Like, I was trying to anticipate her jumping out of the corner, but it's not what she went for. Yeah, I'm trying to use my own projectile, and yeah, I've never seen that attack before. So I was like, what do I do? And right there, I meant to use the projectile, but I messed up. Like, going from walking forward into a Hadouken motion can definitely get that Shoryuken input out. She just, like, crouch for a second, or press back, and then go for it, you know? Uh, so I had a pretty good range for my medium slashes there, but still ended up losing that exchange. And I mean, I have more HP, but she got away from me, yeah? I need her next to me. Oh, oh, wow, we're in the blue. Yo, I should Eason. I never Eason. But it's like, it's the final round, right? Neither win or I lose right here. Dude, she got away. Can I block? All I gotta do is block. No, why did I run in? Ah, yeah, that's unfortunate. But is what it is. You yeah, know, good games too. Mully Goon. Hopefully I can get some more games in with them at some other point in time. GG's.